All right, so I'm gonna show you how to do this on desktop and on mobile, depending on you know what type of creator you are, where you spend most of your time, it'll be valuable for you. All right, so let's go ahead and get into it. So first, what we wanna do is you wanna click on your icon up here. You then wanna click on YouTube Studio. Once it brings you inside of the studio, the first thing you wanna do is you wanna scroll down and if we scroll down for far enough, you can see right here it says recent subscribers, right? So what I want you to do is go ahead and click on see all. And then right here you can see, you know, all of my subscribers. Now, if let's say I want to filter it for the most recent subscribers, all I would have to do is hit date subscribe. And then as you can see, this person subscribed on the 15th, this person also on the 15th, the 14th, the 13th, the 12th. So that's how you could do that. Now, as far as showing like the people who have the most subscribers, you can go right here and you can click on subscriber count and it's going to filter it by the most. And if you want to filter it by the least, all you got to do is just click that again. Now you can see this person has 37,000, 34,000, 29,000, 16,000. Now, another thing you could do is the time frames. So if I come up here, if I click last seven days it's going to show me everybody who subscribed in the past week and then same thing for the 28 days same thing for the 90 days in 365 and so on and so on right now i'm gonna share with you a little tip so when i see people subscribe i like it right because then i get to check out their channel and if i see value on their channel then i'll subscribe it's not really like a sub for sub thing it's just a matter of okay i've seen this this is valuable and then another thing that i look at this this lets me get to know who that person is because now i'm seeing and, you know the content that they're creating and I'm like oh man I really like this person right I'm seeing the personality right and so that's another thing that can help you with your content because if you see the type of people that are following you you can actually start to speak to some of the things that could be helpful to those particular people all right so that's just a little tip I want to share with you and then let's say for instance you do want to subscribe all you got to do is just click subscribe right here and then boom you're subscribed to them now something that's very very important is this right here only includes users who have made their subscriptions public so if somebody has their subscriptions private, then they're not going to show up right here. So let's say, for instance, your channel right now says that you have 100 subscribers, but when you go here, you don't see any subscribers. That means that I, all of those 100 subscribers probably got their subscriptions public. And I'm going to show you where that setting is here in a second. All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and click on this X and then I'm gonna go back to the main home screen, right? Because what most people don't know, let me go back real quick. What most people don't know is that there's two settings. If I click on this, these are these settings right inside of the studio but if i go back out here to the regular home page of youtube and then i click on my picture again let me go ahead and move me out of the way you see these settings right here these are the deepest settings of youtube so right here where it says privacy you can see it says keep all my subscriptions private and then keep all my saved playlists private so what it says is somebody else wouldn't be able to know if i'm subscribed to them or all, at all you said i'm saying so if that's important to you then you could just go ahead ahead and just you know move this setting to make it blue like this and you'll be good to go and they won't be able to see it how like I was just showing uh, my subscribers you know here and here in this video all right so that's how you use the settings now what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna actually show you uh, how to do this on mobile as well first thing we want to do is I'm gonna go right here to my Google Chrome I'm gonna click on that and then up here in the browser right pay attention to this website studio.youtube.com so then from there you want to click on that and you can see it brings me right into the desktop view notice I didn't have to do you know go over here and click on desktop site right there all I had to do was type that website in and sometimes like if it prompts you with something that says do you want to continue on the app or do you want to continue to the website just click continue to the website and then you'll be able to see all of this right here now notice all I got to do is just you know zoom in right there and you can see recent subscribers and if I click on see all just like we did on desktop I can adjust it and I can be able to see it right here on my phone so hopefully you got some value from this video and if you did definitely go ahead and give me a thumbs up also drop me a comment down below letting me know if you have any additional questions and with that being said I look forward to seeing you in the next video peace